They talking about a possible um, government shutdown. Listen. Fiasco. It's a possible government shutdown and the possibility the U.S. could default on its loans. Yeah, Republicans <laughs> say they won't help to raise the debt limit. Our Alexander Lamone joining us live right now from Washington to explain why and what Democrats are planning to do about it. Good morning, Alexandra. Hi there, good morning. Well, congressional Republicans say they know that not raising the debt limit would hurt the U.S. Economy, economy, but still they say they won't help to raise that debt limit because they say they think Democratic spending is just out of control, but Democrats say they have devised a plan. Consequences for our country would be catastrophic. Republicans and Democrats agree that not raising the debt limit and allowing the U.S. to default on its loans would be historic and catastrophic. Still, Mitch McConnell says Republicans will not help to raise the debt limit. The Democrats want to build a partisan future without our input. So Democrats will not get bipartisan facilitators for their purely partisan spending bench. McConnell says Democrats can raise the debt ceiling alone by including the measure in the budget reconciliation bill, which requires no Republican support. And to add to the government's financial problems, on September 30th, the government is also facing a partial government shutdown as agencies start to run out of money. Democrats announced Monday they will try to fight both problems with one bill. The continuing resolution that we'll take up to avoid a government shutdown will also include a suspension of the debt limit through December of 2022. Democrats are trying to force Republicans to vote in favor of raising the debt limit, or Republicans will be blamed for the government shutdown. Democrats are also attaching other strings to the bill. And provide emergency funding necessary to settle Afghan re refugees and those devastated by this summer's natural disasters. And by tying help to the states that were hit by hurricanes and wildfires, Democrats are hoping to at least force the Republican senators from those states to vote in favor of this bill. Report